How's it going folks? Uh, back here again and now we are doing the tackle grab. I know it's been a long time, it's a month late, but uh, we're doing the tackle grab unboxing for the month of April. Unfortunately, tackle grab um, has been having some issues with their new shipping company, so everything's a little bit backed up. Like I'll have the May box in June and you know, yada yada. But um, without further ado, uh, here's the April box. Again, when I get the May box, I'll do, I'll probably do, um, I think every box after, you know, from this point on, I'm just going to open up in my boat and I'm going to take them fishing. Just, you know, pretty much how the MTBs one work, ones work. Um, so pretty much every box from this point on, that's what's going to happen. But for now, um, since this is only the April box, I'm just going to open it for you. Um, there is one more in there that I've already taken out of the package because we, we were doing some walleye fishing in the river uh, a little while ago and I was chucking that around. No luck, but the thing works phenomenally, so we'll get into that. But uh, here we go. We're going to open it, open it up and get started. So first off, you have the what's in the box. Um, you know, your standard stuff, it'll tell you. Got yourself a sticker, as always. Um, first things first, if it's, it, it should be in here, yes it is. I know it's out of the thing. It is called a Sabeel Bull Minnow. Um, and I, I, I took it out of the box yesterday, or the other day, because I was, uh, we were fishing for walleye and I wanted a jerk bait that had a little bigger profile. And this thing, I'll tell you what, man. It's got an internal, like a one knock, but it's got that, that slide so you can launch these things a mile. Um, it's already, I think it's a half ounce to begin with. Um, uh, yeah, I'm not sure, but it, it's, it's a big bait. Um, yeah, it's a half ounce, two to five feet floating. Um, and it's just, you know, it's, it's, it's just a fat bait. Usually you see a jerk bait and you see from the bottom and blah, blah, blah. But you, then you look on the top here and it's just, it's got this big wide, almost like diamond and it just it moves a lot it's a great slash bait it's got a lot of side to side action and um i think we're going to catch some big fish on it this year it doesn't even really work like a natural jerk bait it kind of it's kind of in between a jerk bait and a crank bait which i like um but that's a sabeel bull minnow great little bait i'm sure i'll be catching some fish on it again it's got a nice little one knock in it uh next thing this is a tackle grab exclusive black angel lures um if you go on blackangellores.com, type in tackle grab 10, you get 10% off any order. And that goes along with, I would assume, <laughs> uh, this Black Angel Lures hand tied jig. This is a 5 16 ounce. Um, I believe it's a ball head jig. But I'm really actually excited about getting these kinds of things because I'm getting into smallmouth fishing a little bit more. And yeah, it's just your standard small hook. Um, I have to cut the weed guard down a little, but you know, long, long skirt. It's a really interesting skirt design. See, it even has like a little cup, like a section of trailers, which is interesting. I'm not sure if I'm gonna cut those off or not yet. But your standard ball head jig, not a bad, you know, pretty cool looking lure. Um, next is a gambler. They do gambler every month, which is fine. Uh, burner craw. Just to give you an idea of what that looks like, um, I've used something similar, and I can't remember the name of it. But Yum makes it. Um, this I kind of like a little better because it's got a fatter, fatter body. I think it'll fit better on as a Texas rig. On um, the other ones that I've seen or used, it's a similar style to this bait, but they're small, so you almost have to put them on a jig or a swim jig or something. This would be a perfect flipping bait. And finally, uh, there's another Sabeel. This is called a Racer Crank. It's a two-inch crankbait. It's only an eighth in an ounce. Really good for spinning gear, I would think. Um, it's got a transfer weight system in it. Uh, six to eight feet deep. Um, the thing I like about this lure is if, say, I'm going to a lake and I'm really not sure, um, you know, what I want to fish for. Do I want to fish for largemouth or smallmouth? Or, you know, do I just want to chuck around? This is kind of one of those in-between baits that'll kind of catch everything, catch a bit of everything. Um, it's not super big by any stretch of the word. It's got a little internal ball, so it'll cast a little further. And it's just got a nice standard pattern. I think smallmouth would crush this. It's small enough that you can catch crappie and perch and sunnies on it. Great little spinning crank. I don't think I'd throw this on a um, bait, a bait casting gear, but nice little spinning crank. Um, so let's just get into it. I didn't get into this in my other video, but what's in the box? You have 
You have a Sabeel Action First Bull Minnow, that's $8. You have the Finesse Jig from Black Angel, that's $4. Uh, Sabeel Racer Crank is 7 And then a four pack of Gamblers, 268 So the overall deal, you're looking at 8 12 you know, 19 like 20 something bucks. Uh, you know, great overall baits. Um, real excited to use them. And uh, like I said, next month I won't be doing this style anymore. I'll just be opening them up on uh, in the boat and then fishing with them. So stay tuned. It's going to be good. And uh, thanks for watching.